Last month, Air Force techs and maintainers conducted the first hot loading, or integrated combat turn, for the branch's Runway Queen F-35As, a process that entails rearming and refueling the stealth fighter as quickly as possible with the aircraft's engine still running. Now, integrated combat turns, or ICTs, were once a pretty common facet of American air power, but after the end of the Cold War, the practice largely fell out of favor. In recent years, it's made a big resurgence, however, and the U.S. Marine Corps has already spent the past few years maturing this practice for its own vertical landing F-35Bs. Now, older fourth-generation fighters are arguably easier to manage in these hot-loading scenarios because the procedures for doing so were already worked out during their heyday in the Cold War. And, of course, fifth-generation fighters like the F-35 carry their weapons internally rather than under wing. Last April, Air Force maintainers set a new ICT record for turning F-15E Strike Eagles around and getting them back into the fight against Iranian kamikaze drones in just 32 minutes. But despite the added complication that comes with fifth-generation fighters, the Air Force says they think they can whittle the F-35A's ICT time down to as little as 25 minutes with continued refinement. Of course, doing that safely is the real challenge. After all, pumping more than 2,500 gallons of highly explosive jet fuel into an aircraft at a rate of 600 gallons per minute, while the most powerful turbofan ever affixed to a fighter is still roaring and another half dozen techs are bolting high explosives into the fuselage, well, it's all enough to send most insurance adjusters into cardiac arrest. But the Air Force sees these risks as manageable through practice and procedure, effectively starting slow and then speeding up the process with each repeated iteration until the most streamlined but safe procedures have been identified. Now, this process has really just begun, and we are sure to hear more about it as it continues to mature.